that was the first thing he had me write down was celebrate. And the interesting thing is it goes off from the last word. See, that word I just shared, that prophetic word, was from another previous day. This now was from yesterday. And so it's like a continuation of when I left off with God. God will do that. When you're spending time with God and you're doing that, he'll continue where he left off with you, even if it was days apart. He's that cool. So God says, celebrate. He then said, king has come. The will of God be done. That's what he said to me. And then he said, good things to come. And then I was taken in a vision. And here we go. So I had a vision. I saw a glory going out to the expanse of the world. It went as wide as the planet, but then it went as forward, but in a fast forward motion. It wasn't forward as in normal time. This light, this glory of God went in a fast forward motion. It was, it was so quick. And um, I was just, as I was looking at this vision, I saw that this glorious light was, was so heavenly. There's no light to describe this. It's a glorious, a gold glory. It's, it's a type of gold light. It's not orange. It's not yellow. It's its own thing. It's its own thing. And this type of glory covered the whole planet and it, and it went forward so massively. Nothing could stop it. The light plowed through creation. It, it touched any matter and anything. Everything was touched by this. Everything was. I then go on to describe how gold and how much light is flowing forward. It's just a, it's an overpowering river, what this is going to be. It's an overpowering river. Right? It was like, I watched it go forward, fast forward, and it covered the whole earth. And when it covered the whole earth, it didn't like dissipate. It stayed. This, this glory was covering everything. Like even if my coffee cup was sitting on the table, the glory of God would have covered that. This is how detailed the glory was. It was that, it was that covering. So it was like literally a blanket over the earth. But then because the way the earth was formed, it looked like an upside down lake. If you look at a lake, it's like a, it's a U, it's like a cup. If you were to turn that upside down, it will cover the top of the earth. This glory I was watching, it covered the earth and it just sat there. And it just sat there. And it was so beautiful to see because it was like a blanket, but then it was like an upside down lake of glory. And it just let, and it just sat on the planet, the whole entire planet. And so as I was watching this, I was amazed. I was amazed at what I was seeing because I understood how much power. I understood what comes from that. I understood that there is, it will be guaranteed impossible happening all the time. Guaranteed impossible. There will be no space between heaven and earth. It is just heaven on earth, okay, for this last revival. I then see, remember the last word God just had me share was talking about children, right? God is going to redeem that. He's going to bring that all back. Because I saw this next. After seeing this blanket, I said, I see children of multiple nationalities smiling in this glory surrounded by them. I see, I saw children of different nationalities all of them they were all smiling they were they were just looking up and they could the glory was covering them and they were just in all of this an emotion of joy that is not found on this planet you can't find this joy here you can't find this emotion here it is not here it is something altogether beautiful beyond this place so this glory was surrounding them and they were standing there I heard in the spirit I was watching this vision, change is coming. They will not hurt anymore. They will know me. They, will, they have cried unto me for help I have provided. Then God said, here I come to bring restoration, power, and abundance. Oh, how grace flies in my wings. I send it forth. Come and receive my heart. 
hear my heart sound off to my love for you. You are the blessed design of my creation. Remember my heart for it beats for those in need. I have a plan. Believe. He had me write that in all caps. Believe. And that was the second word he gave me.